guys welcome back to my youtube channel thank you so much for coming back i'm really excited about today's video as i know that you guys really enjoy watching my hauls sort of seeing what i've been purchasing and shopping and sort of trying on i love watching them on youtube too so i absolutely love putting them to get uh, putting them together and today's one's a really exciting one because here in Australia we've just got H&M that's just launched online so we've had it in stores for I mean we've had H&M stores for quite a few years now but we've never had it online so I've always been so jealous of everyone overseas so in the UK and America and stuff like that always getting to shop online especially this year with I think COVID and being at home a lot more obviously shops were shut um, like bricks and mortar stores so online has been really important this year for online um, fashion retailers and stuff like that so I'm really excited to show you what I picked up from H&M sorry that this video has taken so long it took quite a while to come and this is what I'm really I'm hoping crossing my fingers that some of these pieces are still available for you online if they're not I'll still still link them down below because I have noticed that they've been restocking stuff so I'll try and link everything down below for you but yeah, as um, everyone sort of ordered, I jumped on the very first day they launched and it took quite a few weeks to get here. So I think they were just sort of busy and stuff like that. But anyway, we will jump right into today's haul. I've got quite a few bits to get through. So I'll sort of try them all on for you. I have tried them all on so that I can come on and sort of tell you how they fit. And um, there's definitely a few pieces that won't be staying, won't be making the cut, but I'll show you those in the cutaways. So first up we've got this balloon sleeve shirt which I purchased. This one was $29.99 so a really really great price point. It's really comfy and it's got a really good sort of thickness. It's not too thick which is perfect for summer and stuff like that at the moment but it's very large. I don't know if you can see it in there but you'll see it definitely better in the cutaways. I got it in a medium which I went for sort of that more oversized vibe but I definitely could have sized down. So I would recommend probably just going your normal size, unless you want it super oversized. I mean, I'm happy to keep it and be really oversized, but I definitely could have easily gone my size down. It's got these really gorgeous, really oversized balloon sleeves, which is why I liked this. It is a great sort of just classic white shirt, which you can never go wrong. You can never have too many of those, but I wanted this one to be sort of more um, street, sort of, you know, a bit more cool and ca um, casual rather than just like a classic work shirt. So I wouldn't wear this one for work, but definitely more just maybe paired with a little knit vest over the top, which I know is really trending at the moment. Even just um, also tucked over some like leather leggings or some black jeans, blue jeans, even stuff like that. Really easy to dress up and dress down. So next up is probably one of my favourite pieces from this whole haul. It's these trousers. These ones were $39.95. I'm just going to check. Yep. And I got them in a size 10. Again, I just was really unsure with the H&M sizing as I haven't really purchased heaps and heaps from them compared to say Zara and stuff like that. So I sized up. In turn, I probably could have got away with the size 8, but I'm actually happy that I got the size 10 in these. They're this really classic like tailored suit pant. They're a little bit high waisted, which I absolutely love. And the colour is just stunning. I don't know if you can sort of see there. They're the perfect shade of like a neutral light beige, which I've really been missing in my wardrobe. They're not like super oversized or baggy or anything like that. They're definitely more of a classic pant, which I've been really wanting. So I can't wait to wear these with sort of like bodysuits tucked underneath or shirts tucked in, stuff like that. They're also really going to be great to wear with blazers. Definitely wear them for work. So if you're after a good pair of work pants in a beige color, to sort of mix it up from say black and darker colors, these are great. I'll show you in the cutaways, but I would say I probably am going to get them tailored a little bit. I'd like to get them taken in around the waist. They're just slightly too big, but I really like the high waist sort of length, so I'll definitely just get them tailored. Also, what I was going to mention too, I love that they've got belt loops. So many pants these days I find I absolutely love, but they just don't come with belt loops. And I love putting belts on and stuff like that. So these are a great pair that come with the belt. So next up is another one, which I really love this, but I'm just not sure. It's sort of a piece that I really loved online and it definitely looks a little bit different. So it's this gorgeous frill blouse. I think this one was $39 or $34.95, I think. I got this one in a size 10, which I definitely recommend. So I've sort of sized up. Usually I'm sort of about an 8 in most tops, but I sized up to get the 10 and I don't think I would have wanted to go any smaller. It's also a bit cropped, which I think is why I don't really love it, but it's got this gorgeous sort of um, frill 
detail on the sleeve. Also these really cute sleeves here which I love but yeah I just I think it's quite thin and I would have loved it if it had been a bit thicker and I think it would be a bit see-through. These bits here are see-through. I don't know if you can tell that but when you've got like a bra on I feel like you can see it. Um, but yeah I will try it on again. I might mix it up and tuck it into sort of some blue jeans or some leather shorts or something like that just to style it up a bit more and see if I could get wear out of it but I'm a big believer in if you try something on and you don't love it straight away sort of don't linger with it don't keep it in your wardrobe because you, it's just going to sit there then you're never going to wear it and you're always going to think I probably shouldn't have got that but I think that's one of these pieces which I love and I really wanted to love it but I just don't <laughs> So next up I've gone for some swimwear which we're coming into summer here in Australia and swimwear, they're both one pieces, it's just something I don't have a lot of. I just feel like I don't get enough time to go to the beach and I just never seem, every season comes around and I think okay this year maybe I'll treat myself to a nice pair of bathers or something like that and I just never do it. So I sort of wasn't sure with these two, they're very similar by the way but I got both of them thinking that I'll pick one of them but now that they're here I really like both of them. So the first one here sort of reminds me of that like Hun I don't know how to say this brand but Hunza Hunja Hunza G um look it up they've got really really beautiful stuff but it's sort of that like ribbed ruched sort of color um sort of fabric sorry really nice back they're both $39.95 I'm not sure if I mentioned that already I love the little detail here of the tortoise shell sort of buckle detail really comfy on so I'll try them on in the cutaways for you but um, yeah, they're just really flattering. It's got darts here, which makes it really flattering as well. Really nice. I love the color. It's sort of like a, it looks a bit white in the camera, but it's definitely more of like a bone beigey color. And then this other pair that I got, again, the same sort of fabric. It's sort of that ruched. It does have a bit of a glitter detail, which when it arrived, I thought, oh, that's so not me. <laughs> glitter. I don't know if you can see it. Probably not in the camera, but I actually tried it on and I actually really like it. And it was one of those things that I thought actually really like it and I didn't think that I would and that doesn't happen very often with me because usually I know exactly what I'm gonna like so yeah very 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 similar <laughs> but um, yeah just really great also for the price point because I find that bathers unless you wear them all the time I mean I don't live in a really hot part of Australia so some people here that live in like Queensland stuff like that you might wear or you've got a pool you might wear your bathers way more and I can definitely you know see why you would spend more money on them but I just don't wear them that much unless I'm going on a holiday or something which at the moment we're not <laughs> we haven't really been going anywhere but I sort of just think sometimes swimsuits can be so overpriced like hundreds of dollars and I just don't wear them that much so I'm happy to just sort of get a more affordable pair which I really love these ones so definitely check out H&M swimwear if you're looking for some new swimwear so this one's another one that I absolutely love it's just one of those pieces that it came and it was exactly like I thought it was going to be which I was really happy with it's this collared sort of oversized sweater so it's got this collar detail which is really trending at the moment I'm absolutely loving this sort of it's a bit more like vintagey oversized dad vibes which I really love but I really love the sleeves on this it's sort of like this balloon sleeve which I think is so gorgeous and I went the size medium so I sized up in this one just to get that oversized fit I really wanted to sort of get an oversized white jumper I didn't have enough white sort of in my wardrobe in terms of sweaters and casual stuff so I wanted to get one just for spring summer I can't wait to pair it up with sort of like bike shorts or leggings and stuff like that but also really cool it would just be really nice to wear it back with like some casual jeans or denim shorts in summer as well it's a really good thickness too it's sort of that like cotton terry fabric it's not like fleecy or anything like that which is perfect for this time of year and yeah I just really love that one and that one was $34.95 which is really really great price point Okay, I'm absolutely obsessed with this um, pair of jeans that I picked up. I've really been wanting a pair of like off-white, they're pretty much white, but like a neutral pair of jeans that aren't straight leg because I do have a pair of skinny white jeans, which I love, but I really wanted that sort of like a bit oversized, bit of a mum jean. These ones are so great. So these were $39.99, which again, great price point. The denim, I just can't sort of explain to you how good the denim, it's like really soft denim. So it's really comfortable. They fit perfectly. I got the size 10. So I sort of, they're a little bit oversized. I probably could have gone down, but I wanted these sort of to be like an oversized mum jean, which again, yeah, really happy with the sizing and the fit. But yeah, really, really great. They just fit really good. As soon as I tried them on, I was like, yes, they just fit perfectly. They feel comfortable. They're the right length as well, which I'm a little bit on the shorter side. So if you're anything like me, sometimes it's harder to, you know, find that perfect length um, around the ankle. But these are a total winner. 
So next up, we've got something that's really on trend right now, super trending all over the world. You see it all over on Instagram, stuff like that. I just can't work out if this trends for me. I don't know if I just haven't picked up the right pieces yet. I really, really want to love it. I love it on other people. I just think I didn't get the right pieces, but I'll show you anyway, which I really love these. Actually, I think if I had got the right size, maybe. Um, so I picked up this shacket, which I'm sure you all know, shackets are just literally everywhere at the moment. This is a really great one. It's like a denim, sort of a thick, it's probably more like a jacket, you know, like a denim jacket, but it's more like a shirt version. So I really love it. I got the size medium and I think that was my downfall. Sometimes I do this, I don't know if anyone does that where I think I want to go oversized, but it's already oversized. And I wish they would state that in the description, like go your normal size. So anyway, I sized up probably, it's like really large. It looks like it could be my boyfriend's or something. <laughs> so it definitely looks like it could nearly fit Harry. But anyway, love the color. So maybe if you go your normal size, it'll look great on you. But I just sort of didn't know how to wear it. And I think I've also been wanting to get more of a shacket with a waist tie because I feel like that suits me a lot better. But if you're a bit taller and you sort of suit that oversized vibe, this will look really great on you. Whereas me, I just didn't love it on me. I think it just sort of, again, swallowed me. It made me look sort of just all over the shop. So I didn't love it. I have another shacket coming as well, which I don't know. Let me know in the comments if you think I should keep. So maybe I'll show you that next. So while we're on the topic of shackets, I picked this one up, which is sort of like a faux leather, which is super trendy. And I think it's so cool right now. Again, I got this in a size medium as well. I was, must have been having a real like oversized moment. Again, I'll show you in the cutaways. Let me know what you think. I just think I don't know how to style it. I just, I feel like because it's oversized, it's meant to be sort of baggy and bulky, which I do love sometimes. But I just don't know if I can love sort of work out how to style this on me. But I'll try and in the cutaways. Let me know what you think down below if I should keep this one or not. Because this one I'm really on the fence about. Um, but yeah, I think if it had a waist tie, I would love it. So I'm trying to work out, can I like belt it? Because I really love it. I mean, it's definitely a bit hot at the moment in our, sort of, it's coming into um, summer here. So it's a little bit hot, but again, leather shirts, leather pants, stuff like that. They're never going to go out of style. So you can wear those every year, which is great. Okay, so next up we've got a dress. I have already showed this one over on my Instagram, so you may have already seen this. Sorry in advance, but this, again, it's one of those pieces. Let me just look up how much this is actually. I have a feeling it was really affordable. I mean, everything from there is, but yeah, $29.99. Like, so, 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 so affordable. So, it's this really gorgeous maxi collared shirt dress. So, it's just a classic shirt dress. Really classic sleeves, the collar, everything. Really, really maxi. <laughs> I can't, definitely can't fit it into the frame, but you'll be able to see this in the cutaways and over on my Instagram, which I'll include here. Shameless plug if you don't already follow me. But again, I absolutely love shirt dresses and this one, they've really nailed it. It's like the perfect weight as well for like spring, summer. It's not thick. It's not heavy and sort of weighty. It doesn't weigh you down. It's really light. And I just love how versatile they are. So you can just wear it with like sneakers and stuff like that to be really casual. But you can also put a waist tie around it or a belt, put on some loafers or even some heels and it makes it a bit more classy. Just add some accessories. But yeah, I really love this one. So I think I would love it in white. I don't know if they did it in white, but it'd be one of those great ones to have in sort of a few colors because it's so classic. But I went for a size small. So I'd recommend just sticking with your normal size. It was really, really great. It wasn't like too baggy and it definitely wasn't tight. So I'd say just go for your normal size. So next up, I've got another dress, which seriously, wait till you see this on me in the cutaways. <laughs> I tried this on, although I pulled it out of the bag and I thought, oh my gosh, what have I ordered? But it's one of those things that online, and I've actually seen this exact dress start up on someone else, but I think... I don't know if mine was just like a dodgy version or I don't know. Anyway, it's this collared shirt dress, which usually I would love. It's like a white, well, it's meant to be white. It's like this oversized shirt dress with these really gorgeous balloon sleeves. I got the size small. So this isn't one of those ones like earlier that I sized up when I shouldn't. I am a small, but oh my gosh, it literally makes me look like, like I'm a scientist. I'm in like year 10 science class. It's so big and so baggy and baggy and daggy. <laughs> I don't know if that, that can be the new hashtag, baggy and daggy, because literally it's just like an absolute fail. Plus, it's meant to be white. I don't, you're not gonna be able to tell in the camera. But it's like got this, like, it literally looks like I've washed it with some gray stuff and it's like gone bluey gray. Let me find something that's like actually white. So here's the shirt from earlier. Let me see if I hold it up. Or, I don't know if you'll be able to tell on the camera, but it's just like 
very blue gray which just made me feel like has someone already washed this I don't know anyway it's an absolute fail and a no from me I don't know it made me feel like going to like science school or something this would be great because I think it would really suit the vibe but yeah I just I really wanted to like it but it's a no <laughs> So I've got another dress here which is an absolute winner. I think everyone's going to love this. I know you guys are going to love this because I just really, really love it. It's like a t-shirt, really soft, like a really light knitted fabric. I don't know if you can see that there. It's really comfy. It's got this collared detail with these gorgeous buttons. It's a really lovely like maxi length. I'll show you, I'll show you this in the cutaways, but it's really gorgeous, super flattering. And let me just check the price on this one. So this one was $34.99. I got the size small, which I think, yeah, it's perfect size. It's like that perfect oversized casual vibe dress. Really love it. I've just worn it back. I've worn it once to sort of try it on and style it up. And I wore it just with my Gucci black loafers, but I think we're really good just with any slides, even sneakers like white sneakers or your Vasia trainers or something like that absolutely love it and if you're from here in Australia it's sort of you'll know this brand but it really reminds me of like a Vic and Woods like Victorian Woods um, sort of style it's that really good vibe and the quality is actually really great for H&M like I wouldn't expect this to be H&M but yeah anyway so this is a total winner I love this one this would be probably my top five out of this pick okay so this piece is one of those ones that Again, I think you're going to love it. It's really super on trend right now. It's this gorgeous sort of like collared shirt, but it's a fine sort of like a ribbed knit. I'll just sort of show you there. I got the size small, so definitely just go for your normal size. These aren't meant to be worn like oversized. They're definitely meant to be like fitted. Um, really love this one. I have some of these from Naked Fashion, which I sort of got in more of like a beigey color, but I really loved the white. I think this comes in a few other colors. It might come in gray and maybe black as well. Really great to just tuck in. I think these look great tucked in because they are sort of like tight. Tuck them into like jeans or leather trousers or something like that and just like yeah, cute little necklace or something. But yeah, really great to just also great for layering because they're thin enough like that you can just pair them under like a leather jacket or a coat or a blazer and they sort of don't get too bulky around the arms. I hate when you have like too thick a layer and it sort of makes you look like the Michelin man. <laughs> Really great sizing. It fits great. So this one's $29.99. Just checking the price there on my app. Really great price point for this one. I think for the other ones that I mentioned, I paid maybe more like $50, something like that. So these are really, really great. And just like a staple basic, I think you'll get so much wear out of them. The next piece, it's a super trending piece right now. I really wanted to love it. I see so many girls styling them up and that is balloon jeans. So like the oversized sort of like baggy balloon jean. I really love them. And one of my favorite girls on Instagram, Lydia Tomlinson wears them. She looks stunning. I think, I don't know if because I'm like a little bit shorter, they just, I don't know, they fit and they're a great fit. And I love this pair. So if you really like this style and they look good on you, I would definitely recommend them. But I just don't know if I love them for me. But the color's great. I really wanted like a beigey sort of like off-white color. So there's definitely not white. They're more like a beige. Let me try and find. These are the white ones from earlier. Just so that you can see like true white compared to this. See how it's like more like of a beige. But anyway, I'll show you in the cutaways. They're a perfect fit and they're really great. But see how big the leg is? Like that's just like so wide. And I think it just like swallows me up. And I think I just need to stick to more like classic sort of styles on me, especially when it comes to jeans. I think you really need to know what suits your style, what suits your body type as well. You want them to be flattering because I feel like you don't want them to swallow you up or, you know, sort of make you feel unflattered definitely with jeans. So I'll pop them down below though, if they are your vibe, because they are a really, really lovely style. The denim's really comfy. I think they were $39.99, so really affordable, but just not for me, sadly. So last up, I've got one more item to show you. It's not from the clothing range. It's actually a pair of shoes, which I just had a thought before. And this is my first pair of shoes that I've ever got from H&M. Never bought shoes from them before. And I sort of thought I would just go for it, try it out, try them on as well and see the quality. But I must say the quality is really, really great. So let me show you. I've actually already worn them and they're very dirty on the bottom. So I'm just going to try and hold them up so that you can see. They're these white trainers. They're very like Vasia style. So they've got like a beige base, which I really love. They're super comfy as well for the price. Like the quality is actually really good. Just like a white leather um, like that. And yeah, let me just check the price. I know that they were super affordable. So $34.99. I went for my regular size. So I'm a size 39, just like an eight in Australia and UK, I think. And yeah, love, love, love. They're super good alternative to like just like a classic white sneaker. Very like Vasia style. 
and yeah really comfy as well which i was really surprised and i wore them for a whole day to sort of test them out and i was really impressed so i don't know i don't really have to sell you on white sneakers i'm sure because everyone deserves to have a nice white pair of sneaks in their wardrobe they just go with everything and yeah love wearing them all year round so they were really great and yeah definitely recommend well thank you so much for watching my H&M haul I hope you guys really enjoyed it I'm sure there was no surprises from me with these pieces they're all very black white beige but what do you know I'm just very into the neutrals and I know you guys love them as well so thank you so much for watching please let me know down below what you loved out of my haul what was your favorite piece also what do you think of like the shackets and all the stuff that I wasn't sure of let me know if you think I should keep anything or what you didn't sort of love as well let me know what you're buying from H&M as well I love to see what you're sort of picking up or if there's anything you think I should check out because you know, we're all going to help each other out. We're just like all little shopaholics here on this channel. And yeah, love, love, love. I also want to make mention that all of these pieces were really sort of consciously brought. I definitely am not keeping them all. I was just purchasing like a few extra pieces because H&M is just new here. So I wanted to try heaps of stuff on. Obviously, I couldn't go into store at the moment because they were in lockdown. So I wasn't able to try stuff on. That's why I bought a bit extra. So definitely not keeping them all. I definitely don't encourage... Do, you know buying heaps and heaps of stuff but I will say though when you are buying which I often do is I always make sure that they're things that are going to go with everything in my wardrobe that's why I have such a classic wardrobe white shirts black dresses stuff like that you know that they're going to go they're going to last forever in terms of style they're not going to go out of date they're very timeless and stuff like that so please make sure you know if you're buying like a few pieces here and there that's what I think my biggest recommendation will be always make sure they go with things in your wardrobe make sure when you try it on as well I always try to make sure if I'm in the change room or when I online shop at home I always try them on and if I don't have that wow factor I know that it's maybe something that I don't love so you want to love it and you want to make sure you wear it because we've all definitely been there with you know you put stuff in your wardrobe and then you think Five months later I still haven't worn that and it's just like such a waste of your money it takes up your space so make sure you love your stuff girls and yeah happy H&M shopping